everybody, uh, we are back. Sarah Southern going to be here in just a little bit. Uh, you know, folks, before we go on with the program, I just thought I'd address something uh, kind of important. As most of you know by now, our pal Andy here is going to be leaving the show at the end of May, and we're really going to miss him. You know, it's, it's going to be tough. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so it's, it's going to be uh, it's going to be tough without him. And, and I got to say, folks, one question I've been asked a lot lately is whether we're going to replace Andy. And I frankly have always thought of Andy as irreplaceable. And, and frankly, we don't really know what we'll do when he's gone. So tonight, I thought I'd ask our audience what they think we should do when Andy leaves. Uh, I'm just curious, is there anyone up there who has an opinion? I do. Yes, uh, ma'am, uh, what, what do you think we should do when Andy leaves? I think you should get Tom Cruise. Interesting idea, ma'am. I'll look into it, okay? Anybody else? Uh, yes, uh, you right there, sir. I think you should do the show by yourself. <laughs> After all, despite our illusions, we all live and die alone. <laughs> okay, anybody else? Yeah, dude, right here. Right here, dude. Man, I think I'd make a kick-ass sidekick. Wait a minute, who are you, sir? My name's Terry Bondurant, but my friends all call me T-Bone, so you can call me T-Bone. T-Bone, great. And, and yeah. you think you'd make a good replacement for Andy, T-Bone? Hell yes, I would. I, I'm damn funny. Uh, I know lots of good jokes, like, um, there are these two Jew rabbis riding this jet ski. Okay, that, that sounds great. That, that, that sounds great, uh, T-Bone. But, but you see, Andy doesn't really tell jokes. What he does requires very good Thank acting and, and conversation skills. Well, I mean, give me a chance, man. I mean, I can, I can do what he does. Okay, well, well, what do you want me to do? Well, like, you you know, you like you chat, you know. Ask, ask me a question, whatever, man, you know, it don't matter. Like, like what? Anything, man, just ask me. Oh. Uh, Okay, uh, we got a good show tonight. Uh, I'm really excited about it. Uh, how you doing, T-Bone? Shut up! <laughs> yeah. Look, uh, you, 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 no, T-Bone, I mean, uh, you, you got to have a conversation. You, 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 they like that, but you can't just yell, shut up. All right, man, ask me something else. I'll, I'll, I'll do better. All right, uh, hey, T-Bone, what'd you do last weekend? What the hell's that supposed to mean? I ain't no queer. I didn't, I didn't say you were. Oh. Well, ask, ask me another one. I'll, I'll, I'll get this one right. All right, well, uh, T-Bone, where'd you get that jacket? You're stupid. What? Why well, am I stupid? That's a stupid question. Everybody know where I got my jacket on my back, you jug-headed moron. Duh. Uh, really <laughs> funny, T-Bone. <laughs> yeah, not as funny as my boot up your ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is enough. You know, you, sir, will never be able to do my job. Because this job takes understanding, compassion, and sensitivity. You gotta listen. <laughs> Most of all, you've gotta support the host, which... Which is easy, because the host of this show is one of the greatest friends a guy could ever want. You don't deserve this job, buddy, because, well, you, sir, you are a swine. Take him out of here, boys. All right, fine, I'll leave. I, I still got my development deal at Lifetime. Wow, Andy, thanks. What you said was great. You really put that jerk in his place. What do you mean by that? I'm no queer. Okay, we're going to take a break. Sarah Silver, when we come back, stick around.